Hey guys, Claire here, and I have one of my latest acquisitions in the vintage cookbook department. This one is called Oh for a French Wife. It's got a little naked lady on the front, and this is from my beautiful friend Yasmine. She found it while she was in Paris, and I just adore it. It's so, the illustrations honestly for me are the thing that make it, which is so fun. There are these brilliant pen and ink drawings from the 50s. It's really great. So let's see, this was published, Abelyard Press, New York, copyright 1952. It's just this really charming, funny little book uh, written by a couple of gentlemen. Um, the men's names are Ted Maloney and Deke Coleman. They just are really entertaining. It's basically talking about these guys, their love of food, their love of women, and kind of the you know philosophy of cooking and how they approach it. They have really interesting recipes in here too. So they have a section called The Three Cinderella's, which I think is a great name for a title for a chapter. Home at 5.30 which are just kind of these lovely light snacks that a wife can whip up um, when her husband comes home, which is globe artichokes, steak Diane, French salad, Cuban bananas, 12 minutes for spaghetti. I'm gonna actually just jump ahead to that one because the illustration on that page is fabulous. This is what I look like eating spaghetti. It has all these little stories in here as well, but the very end has the actual um, menus written by their wives. So this is like a luncheon by um, Mrs. Coleman, and it has like a salad, uh, niçoise, uh, chicken cannelles, uh, filet of beef with a Bernays sauce. Apparently it comes with poodles. This book is just a really wonderful kind of um, francophilic look at food, women, storytelling. It's very fun. Um, the illustrations, I think, just make it even more so. That's how I feel when I have to do the dishes, personally. Anyway, this is such a charming little book. Um, you can definitely find this with Bonnie Slotnick, who I love in New York. Um, you can also find it on abebooks.com, eBay, Etsy, uh, maybe Janet Jarvis in LA. But anyway, it's really charming and lovely. And I wish I could find the uh, version with the jacket, because I'd love to see what the jacket looks like. Hope you guys enjoyed learning a little bit about this book, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.